right, I'm going to do a very quick walkthrough of the Media Cloud Pro application. Uh, this is the dashboard when you log in. It is a web-based application, so you can use it regardless of what kind of computer you have. Uh, if you click on Find Media over here on the menu, and then uh, click on Images, you will bring up a keyword search function where you can search over 7 million uh, image assets. And so let's just say we want to search for man, all right, because one thing that a lot of people like to use is stock images of people specifically. And so certainly you're going to find plenty of people stock images in this massive library of over seven, th seven million assets. Now let's suppose we want a man uh, using a computer because that's something that I would tend to use in uh, a sales video or a PowerPoint presentation or something like that. So obviously you can see plenty of very relevant results being uh, returned. And of course we can continue to load more images and there's probably hundreds of maybe even thousands of results and we can continue to narrow it down from there. Uh, so that's the image search. Then you have the GIFs slash stickers search. And so let's say we want to search, we'll just, again, we'll search for man, okay? So uh, here we can see some GIFs, a lot of funny stuff. These are things that you can use for uh, social media, for going viral. Um, uh, let's type in the word funny and see what it comes up with there. All kinds of funny GIFs, and I'm sure we can keep scrolling down and loading more and more and more. Uh, then you can also uh, search for stickers. Let's search for funny stickers, see what it comes up with all kinds of funny stickers. And then the next one is a pro feature. That's uh, videos and memes. Uh, again, well, let's search for woman this time. Woman videos. And we can see all kinds of uh, woman videos. And we can also search for memes. All kinds of memes that we can use. And all of these, so we can instantly uh, download them. We can add them to our library within this media cloud. So you can basically create your own collection of assets that you can refer to in the future. Uh, and then you can also uh, instantly edit the images, which I'll show you in a moment. Uh, you can also search for icons. Let's just search for, uh, let's say, let's say tree, tree icons. Uh, Okay, so basically these are like, you know, PNG format type of images. Uh, next we have something called campaigns. This is where you can actually uh, create uh, videos, edited videos. And then we have, uh, let's see, your own in-house library. Oh, sorry, I'm skipping one. We've got audios. And here you can actually download, this is a, a pro feature as well. Uh, you can download uh, 12 collections of stock audios. And then you've got sound effects. And here you've got it organized by category. So let's say we want some electronics related sound effects. I'll click on that category. And here you can see all kinds of things ranging from a phone ringing to camera shutter. Uh, we've got 56 sound effects just in that category. Uh, that's a pro feature as well. Um, then we have the library, which is basically where you can save any of the assets to your personal library. And then we have uh, image assets that you can uh, download as well. So these are like basically like fire sale packages included within the Media Cloud Pro. So you know each of these could easily be a launch within within itself. These are, in fact, many of them were uh, standalone product launches for stock image packages. And you get to download all of these massive packages as well as these packages of over 8,000 GIFs. And then the video assets uh, is a pro feature. You've got HD videos. You've got thousands of HD videos that you can download. And then you have 4K videos as well. I believe there's at least 750 actual 4K stock videos for you to download instantly. And then you get the logo collection. Again, you've got some samples here and then you've got the packages that you can instantly download. You've got the viral quotes, which is a pro feature. Again, some uh, previews and then all kinds of uh, quote packages for you to instantly download. And then you've got the avatars. Again, these were launches on their own. It could be just this, and yet this is just one little component of Media Cloud Pro. And then you have vectors. These are basically uh, PNG images. You have, I mean, thousands, tens of thousands of 
images that you can download. You've got 3D covers as well as 2D covers and then we have other assets which includes quite a lot including uh, PowerPoint covers, uh, CD designs, Facebook timeline covers, uh, funnel image designs, affiliate banner designs, uh, money back seal designs, call to action button designs, background images. This is basically like a massive graphics fire sale package, again, included here within Media Cloud Pro. And then the bonuses, well, don't underestimate the bonuses because each of these, once again, has, has basically been a standalone launch. I was actually blown away when I saw what we we're including here. Uh, we've got this, the animal stock images bundled, the beautiful outdoors, the humans. Uh, some of you may remember this was a, a, a top seller, right? Humans stock images bundle um, just on its own. And yet you're getting this in here just as part of this bonus collection. All of these are bonuses for to, that can be instantly downloaded. And there are video packages, graphics packages, uh, all kinds of uh, graphics and image packages that you can download here. And then, of course, the support link. Now, the last thing I was going to show you was um, how to instantly edit an image. Let's go back to images, and we'll search for man again. And if, if I click on one of these images, uh, you can see if I just hover over it, it gives me the option to either edit it with Pixo Editor or edit it with PhotoP. All right, and so these are uh, online editing programs that uh, they're no additional cost and you can edit these images um, directly out of Media Cloud Pro. So if I, for example, click on Edit with Pixo Editor, it's going to open that image in Pixo Editor. So I don't have to go through the process of downloading it and uploading it and all those things. It is simply going to transfer it directly into Pixo Editor where I can then uh, begin to edit it. And you can see here it says Edit Photo. Okay, and from here, you can uh, apply filters, all kinds of different filters. You've got stickers, you've got text, you've got blur, frame, shape, draw, crop, transform, all kinds of things, and then you can instantly save it. So it's as simple as that without having to go through the extra steps of you know, downloading, uploading, and all those things. You can simply edit it directly out of Media Cloud Pro and then uh, save it exactly how you want it. And then uh, the same thing with Photo P. If we click on the Edit with Photo P, it is actually going to open that image in Photo P. All right, and for those of you that may not be familiar with Photo Photo P, it is essentially a, a clone of Photoshop. Okay, it has basically the same features and tool layout as Photoshop has the same functionality, it has the ability to create layers, and so you can edit it right here using all of this, the standard tools that you would find in Photoshop and then save it directly. So just one more of the many powerful features that you'll find in Media Cloud Pro.